Hey guys, it's Hossa, and Valentine's Day is coming up pretty soon, so I was thinking what better way to celebrate than with Beanie Boos. So today, I'm going to be showing you guys my Valentine's Day Beanie Boo collection, so let's get right into it. First up is Cookie! She was released in 2011 alongside the very first set of Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. She's an adorable beagle holding a pink heart, and she is one of the many, many versions of the Beanie Boo Cookie. Next up is, you guessed it, another Beanie Boo named Cookie. I guess Ty really wanted people to have two options that Valentine's Day. The biggest difference between the two is that one of them is completely pink while the other one is a little brown. Next up is Julep! She is a really cute pink monkey holding a red heart in her hands. And you know, you can really tell that these Beanie Boos are just classics because they have the solid eyes and the classic purple tag. And there you have the first set of Valentine's Day Beanie Boos from 2011. Next up is Jungle Love from 2012. She is a hot pink giraffe with red accents and a little tiny red heart. And this Beanie Boo was actually in like one of my most popular unboxings because I think I ordered her from Ricari or something. And when she came, she literally didn't have a nose. I was low key panicking, but I'm really glad that my mom was able to fix her. Then we have Tender the Elephant, and I literally love this Beanie Boo. She is pink, and she is really unique because she has, like, this heart on her chest, and it's connected to her, like, with a little golden chain, and she has this really cute heart pattern on her ears. I remember being so excited when I found her because she is kind of rare, and I found her at a Goodwill, which was just amazing. And those were the 2012 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. Next up from 2013 is Smitten the Toad! And we literally only have two Beanie Boo Toads, so this just makes her all the more special. And like, just look at how chonky she is! I love it! But yeah, she has a really pretty pink heart pattern. And next up is Sweetly, who is a white polar bear with pink accents and a red heart. And guys, doesn't she look just like those little bear chocolates at the store? I bet she was modeled after those. And if you guys recall, she was one of the main characters in my plastic surgery skit, which was interesting. <gasps> oh. My. Gosh. And there are the 2013 Valentine's Day boos. Then from 2014, we have Mandy the Panda. And I think this design is just so clever, like how they took a panda's like eye markings and they made it into a heart. Mandy is definitely one of my favorite Valentine's Day boos. And I have her in the medium size too. And here we have Fluffy the Lion! And I'm not even joking, this is the very first Valentine's Day Beanie Boo that doesn't have a heart anywhere. But she is a really cool pink lion, and I just love how wild her mane is. And next is Sweetiekins, and I don't know why, but I love saying her name for some reason. But she is a really, really cute pink bear with pink hearts all over her, and a red pink heart in her hands. And then we have Sherbert, who once again does not have any hearts anywhere, but she has this really cool like purple and pink tie-dye all over her. She is a beagle, and I just love her sleepy eyes. And then we have Chloe the Dalmatian! And I'm pretty sure she was the first Valentine's Day Beanie Boo that wasn't a retail Beanie Boo. She was actually exclusive to the store Justice, which makes her pretty rare now because you can find her for like anywhere from $40 to $60 on eBay. And next is Darlin! And I love this Beanie Boo so much! She is like this white dog with pink splotches all over her. She has this really, really cool collar that says XOXO, and a red dot around her eye. She was one of the main characters in my series Beanie Boo Hollywood, and she kind of reminds me of the Target dog just a little bit. <laughs> And those are all of my 2014 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos, and this is definitely the biggest set we've ever gotten. And next up from 2015 is Sugar Pie! I think it is super cool that she was the first Valentine's Day unicorn, but yeah, she basically has just pink hearts all over her. And then we have Cuddly Bear! And she is really similar to Sweetly because she is a white polar bear. But Cuddly Bear actually has red accents instead of pink accents, which for some reason is kind of rare in the Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. And 
And next up is Cutie Pie, who is a super, super cute black and white panda who is holding a really sparkly hot pink heart. And those are the 2015 Valentine's Day boos. And then from 2016, we have Honey Bun the dog. She has really curly white fur and she's holding a little red heart in her mouth. And guys, her fur is so nice and soft. It's like a cloud. And next we have Sugar the Elephant. And her design is so simple, but it just works so well. She is a really pretty pastel pink color and she has a heart pattern in her ears. And that is the 2016 Valentine's Day Beanie Boo set. And from 2017, we have Juliet the Penguin. And I think it's really interesting that they made a Valentine's Day penguin because I feel like usually you don't think of penguins when you think about like Valentine's Day animals. And instead of holding a heart like a lot of other Valentine's Day Beanie Boos, she has it embroidered into her chest, which I think is really cute. And next we have Romeo the Bulldog. And I think it's just great how they made their names matching because they're both named after Shakespeare's play Romeo and Juliet. And I just love this one so much. And next we have Valentina the Panda. And she was actually a Walgreens exclusive because I remember hunting for her. And what is super, super interesting about her is that she has red eyes and I'm pretty sure that she is the only Beanie Boo with red eyes. So like, this is super cool. And I feel like most of the Valentine's Day Beanie Boos are usually pink and not red. So she is just really unique. And that is the 2017 Valentine's Day Beanie Boo set, which in my opinion is one of the best. And now from 2018, we have Sweetums the Giraffe. And to me, she's kind of like an updated version of Jungle Love, but I just adore her color scheme and also how sparkly she is. And next up is Smooches, and he is just adorable. I mean, look at his little different colored eyebrows. He is such an underrated Beanie Boo, and he is the only Beanie Boo dog that looks like this. And that is the 2018 Valentine's Day Beanie Boo set. And next up is Aphrodite the Husky! And this Beanie Boo is so cool to me because I love her color and also her eyes. Her pupils are brown. Like, I don't know if you can see it super well on camera, but look, she is the only Beanie Boo with brown pupils. She was a Walgreens exclusive and she's named after Aphrodite, the Greek goddess of love. So overall, she is just such a cool Beanie Boo. And next up, we have Darling, who is a pastel pink unicorn with a lot of sparkles all over her and a pink heart. And I actually have a double of her, which I totally forgot the reason why, but I mean, the more the merrier, right? And those are my 2019 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. And unfortunately, there actually weren't any 2020 or 2021 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos, but there are 2022 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. First up is Mai the Cat, and she has got to be one of my favorite Valentine's Day Beanie Boos ever because she is a totally new breed of cat, and she is just so cute and well-made. She is very, very pink and very, very sparkly, and I really love all the tinsels they put in her hair. And next up is Hunk the Husky, who was actually pretty controversial this year because a lot of people did not like his name. And he also looks a lot like Aphrodite, but nonetheless, he's still pretty cute. And those are my 2022 Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. And yes, I don't have Snooky. I wasn't able to get her in time for this video, but hopefully I can get her pretty soon. So there you have it, guys. Those are all of my Valentine's Day Beanie Boos. Be sure to tell me in the comments down below which one was your favorite. And I hope you enjoyed this video and that you have an amazing Valentine's Day. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe, and bye-bye!